Welcome to a new Salem Christmas. This is Bobby McAllister. For the next few minutes, join me and my family, New Salem, as we celebrate the birth of our Lord. Thanks for joining us. Our group, New Salem, is made up of me, my wife, Jennifer, our son, Cabe, our daughter, Allie, and Jennifer's mother, Shirley Bradley. The focus of today's program is Jesus, God's gift to the world. And here's Jennifer to introduce our first song. Around 20 years ago, I wrote a Christmas song entitled The King's Lullaby. As I was writing the song, I imagined if I could go back in time and be at the manger when Jesus was a baby, what I would sing to him. Around 10 years ago, we went back into the studio and re-recorded the song and retitled it, Everything to Me. Little baby Jesus, lying fast asleep. Who would think to look at you That you would be King of kings and Lord of lords And everything to me Your Father sent you down to earth To save fallen men That manger that you're sleeping is part of his plan. The angels gather all around, sent for to keep the King of kings and Lord of lords and everything to me. shepherd of your sheep. You are the living word of God. Forever you will be King of kings and Lord of lords and everything to me. Your Father sent you down to earth to save God's gift of salvation through Jesus Christ is the greatest gift I've ever received. I received Him by faith, and with this gift came a whole package of wonderful, wonderful things. The gift of life, my guide, my comfort, my healer, my provider, my everything. I'm so thankful for this precious gift. 1 John 5.11, and this is the record that God hath given to us eternal life, and this life is in his Son. John 1.29 says, 
he is the Lamb of God, which taketh away the sin of the world. John 10.11 says that he is the Good Shepherd. 1 Timothy 6.15 says Jesus is the King of kings and Lord of lords. The Bible refers to Jesus using many different names. Isaiah 9, 6 says, For unto us a child is born, unto us a son is given, and the government shall be upon his shoulder, and his name shall be called Wonderful, Counselor, the Mighty God, the Everlasting Father, the Prince of Peace. And here's Cabe to take us into our next song, Joy to the World. When God sent Jesus to earth, he gave us the greatest gift that has ever been given. Jesus' birth, death, and resurrection from the dead ensured our salvation. But as with any other gift, we must receive it. Romans 10, 9 reads, If thou shalt confess with thy mouth the Lord Jesus, and shalt believe in thine heart that God hath raised him from the dead, thou shalt be saved. I encourage you today to accept, believe, and confess Jesus as your Savior. You will begin to experience the joy of salvation. Joy to the world, the Lord is come. Let earth receive her King. Let every heart prepare Him room. And heaven and nature sing, and heaven and nature sing, and heaven and heaven and nature sing. Joy to the world, the same. God sent joy to the world. It is up to us to receive him. Knowing Jesus is real, everlasting joy. Christmas time is a wonderful time of the year where we give gifts to our loved ones and to our friends. And when we would give a gift to someone who doesn't seem to receive it or appreciate it, we should think about how our Heavenly Father feels. He gave the greatest gift the world has ever known. He gave the gift of His Son, Jesus Christ. If you've not received Him, I pray you will receive Him today. In the book of Psalms, chapter 96, verses 1 and 2, it says, O sing unto the Lord a new song. Sing unto the Lord all the earth. Sing unto the Lord. Bless His name. Show forth His salvation from day to day. In order to have joy your heart has to be changed you have to be born again you have to have received the gift of salvation brought by jesus christ and god has given us all the ability to choose you can choose to accept jesus or you can choose to reject him but the choice is yours god will not make you love him god will not make you serve him but many times god will gently nudge you he'll gently speak to you by his spirit and let you know that you need a savior, let you know that you need Jesus in your life to change you and make you what you ought to be. The last song on today's program speaks about the birth of our Lord Jesus Christ, how there were no trumpets blown, how there were no parades, there was no big celebration, but this little baby born in a manger would grow up to be king, king of our lives when we choose him. This song is called, Love Came Gently.
Thank you for sharing these past few minutes with us. We hope it's been a blessing to you. This is Bobby McAllister inviting you to join us next time as we celebrate Jesus with A New Salem Christmas. Mm -hmm.